Today is National Vietnam Veterans Day, and state leaders are honoring the Virginians who fought in that war. More than 230,000 Virginians served during that period. CBS 6's Caroline Colburn was there for the ceremony and joins us live from the Virginia War Memorial, where the event was held this morning. Caroline. Well, Cheryl, the event actually just wrapped up minutes ago, but this morning, dozens of Vietnam veterans and their families gathered here at the War Memorial, specifically at the Shrine of Memory you see behind me, as Governor Youngkin and other state leaders thanked them for their service. Now, Governor Youngkin specifically recognized one veteran who fought in both World War II and Vietnam. His name is Jonah McKee. And McKee, when he came home from war, he continued to serve and recruit new soldiers. Now, today, March 29th, was officially dedicated as National Vietnam Veterans Day in 2017. But because of the pandemic, this is the first in-person ceremony in years here at the Virginia War Memorial. Now, Governor Youngkin told the crowd more than 230,000 Virginians served in Vietnam, more than 1,300 died, and 46 soldiers are still listed as missing in action. Now, one of Governor Youngkin's top priorities, he told the crowd, is ensuring Virginia becomes the nation's most friendly state for military. Virginia is better because of all of you, and it's why I am so emphatically working towards making sure that all of you stay in Virginia. You're the fabric of our communities. You make us all better. It's why I want to make sure that we no longer tax up to $40,000 of our veterans' retirement benefits. It's why I want to make sure that we're taking care of your families. It's why it's so important that when you want to start a business, we do everything we can to have you start it here. Now, there was also a pinning of Vietnam veterans who served between 1955 and 1975. R. Jake Burns spoke with some of them, and he's going to have the latest on this ceremony on your news tonight at 530. Working for you in Richmond, I'm Caroline Colburn, CBS 6 News.